Hey everybody, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to be painting some of the smaller parts of the model, uh, including the underside of the model as well. Here I'm painting the inside of the afterburner. I'm using the MIG metal color. Uh, it's an acrylic paint. It's called burnt iron slash jet exhaust. I'm also painting the pedal style air brakes that go on the engine, the engine exhaust. Here I'm painting the outside of the air brakes. I'm using Vallejo's model color, Natural Steel. I really like using this. It gives a nice uh, metallic finish. You just gotta thin it down to get it through an airbrush and it sp uh, sprays really nice. I'm going to be using the zinc chromate color to paint the inside of the landing gear doors. I already painted the wheel wells. And looking at reference pictures, a lot of the F-105s did have the green zinc chromate in the landing gear bays and also on the doors. Um, later on though, they, the Air Force started using white. Um, I, You kind of had your choice. So I like the green zinc chromate. It kind of gives a nice uh, contrast to the gray on the bottom and uh, since the bottom is a light gray this green really sticks out and shows and I think it looks pretty neat. I'm going to use this Vallejo metal color aluminum to paint the landing gear and also the wheels. Okay, I'm going to be using this USAAF light gray. It's Vallejo's version of FS36622, otherwise labeled as camouflage gray. 
Um, the underside of the aircraft is all painted in this color, as well as the underside of the drop tanks and the inside of the, or excuse me, the outside of the gear doors. Okay, everybody, I think that's going to do it for this video. In the next video, I'll finish painting the plane and getting it ready for the final reveal. I want to thank you for watching. I appreciate it. And if you like my videos, give me a like and be sure to subscribe and tune in next time. God bless everybody. Take care and enjoy your weekend. Bye-bye.